South Dakota workers are owed more than $600,000, and the money is just waiting to be claimed. In tonight's Your Money Matters, the Department of Labor is showing people how to check and see if they might have any back wages waiting for them. There are more than 600 workers here in South Dakota that are owed uh, combined more than half a million dollars. It's all money investigators with the Department of Labor have collected after looking into allegations of businesses not complying with federal labor laws. And these are wages for hours that they have worked and money that they should have been paid but weren't. Right now, the pool of back wages has climbed to more than $610,000 in South Dakota, with even more money piling up across the nation. There are millions of dollars from across the country owed to tens of thousands of workers that are listed on the WOW. The Department of Labor's Workers Owed Wages portal helps people easily search to see if they could be owed any back wages. You can enter the name of the employer. Uh, you enter if your employer's name comes up, uh, you can search for your name first and last. If your name comes up, you'll be asked to fill out contact information. You can also use the website to look up any former employers of yours from other states. But it has to be somewhere you've worked within roughly the past five years. Uh, it is time sensitive. Um, uh, we are by statute limited to three years to get this money out to the workers. And that's part of the urgency in letting people know this money is out there. Well, if the funds aren't claimed, we're required by statute to turn that money over to the U.S. Treasury, um, and then that money will no longer be recoverable. So a quick search could help bring a big payout. So the checks that are available uh, on WOW to workers right here in South Dakota they vary from as little as $20. Uh, some of them can be as high as $10,000. Money owed for hard work that's already been done. So we just wanted to make sure we get this information out and get this money back in the hands of the workers who earned it. Back wages can happen in any industry, but the Department of Labor says they focus many of their investigations on holding low-wage industries accountable. Well,